Today we are talking about the phenomenon of human sacrifice. It is widely believed that uh, some indigenous tribes in Latin America would carry out human sacrifice, especially the Aztec. According to some statistics, uh, historians claim that they would carry out sacrifices of uh, as high as 800,000 and 400 people or more than 80,000 people. There are some other historians who believe that it could be somewhere between 15,000 to 30,000 a year. Uh, but those who oppose these Spanish claim believe that it was the Spanish propaganda and the temples where these uh, supposed sacrifices have taken place do not offer any concrete evidence the skulls that have been found there uh, uh, run into uh, hundreds now, not even thousands or tens of thousands, which suggest that there could have been some sort of human sacrifice, but it may not be as high as it is claimed by uh, Spaniards. Some historians also raise the questions that if uh, Aztecs would sacrifice prisoner of wars, so they fought a number of wars with Spanish and naturally some Spanish must have been held captives. There are some accounts of Spanish being slaughtered, uh, but uh, we do not know uh, from the original sources. Most of the sources of these exaggerated numbers stem from Spain and most of the Spanish people or either the people who were allied with the Spanish or the people who later develop uh, you know proximity with the spanish uh, they make such claims and uh, those who oppose spanish claims uh, believe that it was basically spanish propaganda because if it uh, more than 80000 people uh, were being sacrificed prior to the advent of the spanish or during their uh, fight uh, then the population of uh, uh, americas or uh, you know south and central america uh, would not have been as high as it was uh, when Christopher Columbus landed that continent. Some historians believe that it was somewhere between 59 million to 60 million. There are others who believe that it was more than 120 million and within a few decades that was drastically reduced owing to the genocides, massacres, diseases, germs and uh, other factors that uh, led to a widespread uh, that led to deaths on an epic scale so human sacrifices is uh, not a phenomenon that is unique to just uh, according to some historians uh, to the tribes in latin america but such forms uh, uh, could be found uh, in europe in india and other parts of the world there are some historians who assert that what we call human sacrifice was a way of execution or a way of killing uh, you know one's enemies for instance uh, it is argued that some uh, people especially from those upper uh, uh, you know upper layer of uh, the social stratification or upper classes of europe their bones would only be buried and their body parts were dis uh, membered and uh, so if their heads or skulls are found today it cannot be concluded that uh, they were involved in human sacrifice in the same way some historians claim that basically uh, the aztec would would not uh, kill their enemy in the battleground uh, they would really resort to killing their enemies because they would consider it uh, dishonorable so they would capture them alive bringing them and then execute them. And uh, if 80,000 number is, uh, um, is, is to be believed, then one needs to think that 80,000 is a great number. How many people might have been involved uh, in the carrying out this mission? If only priests were tasked to carry out this, then the, uh, we have to wonder over the number of priests who may be involved in it. It is widely believed that all history is the history of victors. So, so there is a possibility uh, that Spanish conquerors may have exaggerated. But on the other hand, there are people who do point out uh, strange uh, you know, customs in different parts of the world or different parts of the global south. 
for instance uh, there were certain tribes uh, in africa who would uh, have a strange way of worshiping sati in india before the arrival of the british uh, was a reality it was not uh, uh the fig of somebody's imagination but it existed and it was banned in the same way some people argue that human uh sacrifice did exist and naturally the consciousness of man was not as developed as it is today so there is a strong possibility that because of certain superstitions people of latin america or certain tribes in latin america may have been involved in human sacrifice however the scale of this sacrifice or exaggerated number should be taken with a pinch of salt and one point that has to be taken into account is uh, that that these all numbers came from uh, conquerors they all came from the spaniards so that's why it's difficult to uh, uh, trust them it's difficult to believe in them uh so these numbers should be taken with with a pinch of salt